Joined right now by great head coach Drew Bannister. Drew, your thoughts again? Uh, you know, I thought we played very well. Um, Mike Will played well. You know, coming in under tough circumstances, he gave us a chance to win, and uh, that's what I asked for my goalies. And uh, he certainly gave us, us that tonight. So happy for him, and uh, certainly a good two points for us. I well, certainly thought so. Uh, was the line changed a bit at the start of the game tonight? Uh, I, I just made two two adjustments. I put uh, Mike back up with uh, Jordan and Jade, and moved uh, Mitch down with uh, <coughs> with Brock and Mike, and, and moved Brock back to center. So those were, uh, I guess, three changes that we made, and uh, you know, to to try and to see if we can get something going. And uh, certainly, uh, you know, it, it worked, and we, we got some goals from from Brock, obviously, and, and Mike scored a big goal for us at the end. So it did. Personally. Uh, I thought that this was probably the best defensive game you've played all season. Certainly, we played uh, you know better better defensively, and uh, uh, we needed to you know we needed to be strong in front of Mike and and uh, let him see the puck and, and clear pucks out. Um, we knew he could make the first save for us, and uh, from then on, we were just, we just wanted to clear pucks and and uh, keep it out of our zone and keep it out of the danger zones, and uh, the guys did that very well today. Great result. You pleased with it though? Very, yeah, very pleased. I mean, any time you beat a uh, beat a good hockey team like uh, like Sheffield, under tough circumstances, and, and not having Yakko in net, and having Mike come in and step in and do the job he did, uh, certainly, certainly uh, a big win for us and an important two points to, to keep ahead of uh, Coventry. Certainly was. Uh, Jacko, you've mentioned him there uh, about long term. Uh, we're we're kind of day to day with him, but uh, certainly. Uh, I'm not going to push him. I want to. Uh, I want him 100% healthy for for the playoffs. Mm -hmm. And uh, you know, right now we, you know, Mike's played well for us. So I'll give Mike the chance, and uh, we'll wait until uh, Yako's 100% healthy. And until he is, uh, he won't be in the net for us. Good. The the playoffs themselves. You think there's another level the team can reach? Uh, you know, I, I I think we played. Quite well, even in the three losses, um, you know, we played well with the puck. Uh, unfortunately, there were some goals scored. Um, they were un uncharacteristic of our team, and we had to uh, dig ourselves out of holes. And, uh, you know, tonight we didn't do that, and, and our goalie gave us a chance to win, like I said, and uh, we won the hockey game, and that's what we need. Um, certainly, we can't have starts like we did uh, in the two previous games um, and expect to win hockey games. And uh, uh, we were much better tonight in the first, obviously, and uh, I thought we played a solid hockey game for the whole game. To be honest, uh, I said my own opinion obviously was that even though you lost those early goals in the other games, that they certainly didn't play badly. No, we didn't, and that's, I mean, that's the frustrating part to give up that many goals and then try and get yourself in, obviously, with Cardiff. Uh, we, we certainly could have won that game very easily. Um, you know, we went into Belfast, and again, we gave up, uh, you know, three goals very early in the game, and then, you know, we played very well after that and ended up out shooting them. And uh, other than last night, probably, it was the first time they probably got out shot, shot in the 11th game, 11 games that they had been winning. So for us to go in there, obviously, a tough travel. Uh, we played well. We didn't get the results, but you can't expect to win games if you're going to get about four goals early no. on in the first. So um, we needed to stop that, and and uh, tonight we were we were ready from the beginning, and and uh, we got a good result from it. Certainly, I think if they play def as defensively as that, you, you're going to be a very hard team to beat. We will be because we certainly got the horses up front. We got three lines that we can roll, and they can all be dangerous. Um, we certainly don't have a problem scoring goals. We just we have to be uh, you know committed on the defensive side, especially when we have even have the puck. We have to make smart decisions with the puck, and uh, tonight we did. And uh, you know just just make sure that we uh, we don't give up odd man rushes, and um, you know just just play play a game that we know how to play. And uh, when we were winning our games, we we were playing solid hockey, and we weren't giving up odd man rushes, and that kind of creeped into our game the last few games. But uh, tonight it was better. I would have thought that no team uh, in the league would relish getting us in the playoffs. Um, you know, uh, certainly I think we're a team that uh, you know no one wants to really play, but uh, certainly we need to come to play too. 
and uh, if we're we're hitting on all levels and we're we're a healthy hockey team, I think we can be very dangerous. And certainly we can, and we've proven it that we can beat any team in the in the league. Any preferences for who you like to play? I don't think so. I mean, you have to. Yeah, if you want to win a championship, you have to go through everybody. Yeah. So um, that's the way we're looking at it. And uh, whoever's in front of us first, uh, you know, we're going to make sure that we want to win two games, and then from there we go on uh, and give us a chance to to get into the finals. And it's you know one game and, and get ourselves into the final the finals, and that's all you can ask. We just we need to we can't look at it as a goal differential thing. We need to look at it to win hockey games, and that's what, how we're going to look at it. Yeah. No, look forward to that. Certainly. Coach, thank, you. thank you for your time. Thank you very much. Okay.